If you're asked to simplify the fraction 7 thirds, here's how you do it. We want to find another fraction that's equivalent. It's equal to 7 over 3, it's just that it's in lowest terms. We've simplified it. To do that, we need to find a common factor, the greatest common factor that goes into 7 and 3. And the only thing that goes evenly into 7 and 3 is 1. If we divide 7 by 1, we get 7. Divide 3 by 1, we'd get 3. That's 7 thirds. That's what we started with. So the fraction, 7 thirds, it's already simplified. It's reduced down to its lowest terms. Note that 7 thirds is an improper fraction. The numerator, that's larger than the denominator. So you could change it to a mixed number. 3 goes into 7 two times with 1 left over. And then we just bring the denominator across. So 2 and 1 third, that's the mixed number for the fraction 7 thirds. But in answer to our original question, the fraction 7 thirds is already in lowest terms. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.